Hey, welcome to another episode of Beers Jack of Barbecue. Today we're going to do uh, two chickens. So I got a combo pack at Costco. Um, I kind of rinsed them, blotted them dry, put some pork barrel barbecue seasoning on it. It's kind of good for a little bit of anything. Got that at Costco also. Um, today we're going to actually use, it's as you've seen before, we're cooking on a Big Joe. So we're using the Big Joe rotisserie. So I have it um, already on the rotisserie bar. I have the forks in, seasoning's ready to go. Uh, next thing we'll do is we're going to take it out onto the grill. We're cooking today. Um, grill right now is up around 380. I want to get it, it'll probably settle down at about 350. So anywhere 350 to 400 will uh, be good to get these going. We're going to take the uh, breast to 155 to 160 and uh, everything else should be falling in place. But we'll make sure everything's done completely before we, uh, before we bring them off. So uh, we'll see you out in the grill. All right, like I mentioned inside, we're going to try to cook around 350 to 400. It's really trying to push at 400 because, as you can see, there's some gaps around the rotisserie ring. Um, so I've turned the vents down to kind of accommodate for that, but I'm still okay going at 400 degrees here with the chicken. Um, it'll just be a little bit quicker. That skin might get a little bit crispier. So uh, I'm going to throw the, the chickens on, and we'll start the rotisserie. All right, so uh, <clears throat> they've been on about an hour. Gonna take a peek. They are looking really good. I'm actually gonna shut it down and just do a quick reading um, to see where we're at. According to this one, uh, that was um, about 160, so we're actually very close to being done. We get a good temperature on the breast. That's only about 135, so we got some more time to go. We'll uh, come back, check them out, and uh, start the rotisserie up again. And we're good to go. Things are looking good. All right, so we just opened up the grill. Um, just waiting for the turn so I can get a good reading. Um, on the breast here. All right, we're at uh, 155. So actually, I'm going to uh, just check another spot. That's a little over 160. We're in good shape here. I'm actually gonna, just going to close it just for about three or four more minutes, and then we're going to come out, we're going to yank them off. All right, so as I mentioned, we're going to bring these right back off because uh, everything was looking really good. Temperature was right where we needed, about 155 to 158. We're going to take them in, cover them up uh, for a few minutes, and then we'll be back inside to, uh, to show you what they look like when we cut into them. First things first, sip of beer. One thing I forgot to mention when I started this was I basically just tied up the wings and the legs um, just to keep them from the rotisserie working properly. I'm just going to cut into the breast here real quick. Oh wow, is that tender. Skin feels nice and crispy. Well, if you can see that and look how tender that is, this is going to be one good dinner. All right, so if you like what you're seeing, subscribe to our channel. As always, we'll have our contact information below. And as always, we'll have a, an outline of everything we did tonight. So that way, if there's any questions, it'll be in the outline and you can follow along of what we did tonight. So uh, thanks for joining us and we'll see you soon.